equivalent fractions on a ruler. When I look at an inch, I can see that the base, or the inch, is representing a hole. I can cut that hole into half, so I'd have a half and two halves, or one. I can cut that in half again, getting four equal pieces. So I had one-fourth at the first divide, two-fourths at the second divide. Well, that's the same thing as a half. I have three-fourths at the third divide, and four-fourths at the fourth divide, or the whole. Let's do that one more time. Let's cut an inch into eight equal pieces. I would have one-eighth, two-eighths, or fourth, three-eighths, four-eighths, which is a half, five-eighths, six-eighths, which simplifies to three-fourths, seven-eighths, and eight-eighths, which simplifies to one. Whether I have six-eighths or three-fourths, it doesn't affect the size of what I'm looking at, but sometimes it's more useful to divide a space into eighths, and sometimes it's more useful to divide into fourths.